Oh baby, I'm Alex. Where do we begin? I'm Alex, a prominent YouTuber known for his commentary videos is facing backlash once again and calls for cancellation primarily due to his involvement in past controversies, especially in this one recently that I just kind of get right into all that. You guys already know what it is. Like the video if you enjoyed, but subscribe if you're new. Hit that intro. <laughs> All right, I am Alex, a prominent YouTuber known for his commentary videos is facing backlash once again uh, with calls for his cancellation, primarily due to his involvement in past controversies, especially the Slazo incident. This controversy dates way back to 2019. 2019 was like, what, five years ago? That's insane. Oh, my. When I'm out, all right, 2019, when Alex or I'm Alex supported and amplified unverified allegations of sexual misconduct against fellow YouTuber Slazo. Later, these allegations ended up being debunked and it was revealed that Slazo had been falsely accused, which is a big, big no-no. I'm going to be real. If you're going to accuse somebody of, uh, of something as heinous as that, you should face some jail time. I'm just saying, bro, you should face some jail time. These... these these chicks gotta know. They gotta know. Later, these allegations ended up being debunked. We all know that the fallout from this situation has continued to affect I'm Alex's reputation, uh, with many critics accusing him of failing to properly vet information before publicly condemning Slazo. Find this in uh, Kavos' video and then uh, Becky Elizabeth's uh, video as well. In addition to the Slazo controversy, there have been other instances where I'm Alex has been criticized for his behavior and statements. Some believe he has a pattern of jumping on bandwagons to gain views and followers, which has led to a perception of him being insecure and opportunistic. You know what I'm saying? There's, there's a silver lining to all this. You know what I'm saying? There's a silver lining to all this. You know, Donna's got a whole video. She posted this four years ago. You guys can go check it out. It's got everything. Why the internet turned on I'm Alex. It's a, it's a really good video. Go check that out. Super dope. Super dope. Uh, these issues have resurfaced recently, uh, leading to renewed calls for his cancellation. As many in the uh, as many in the YouTube community demand accountability for his past actions and the damage they have caused to others' repu uh, reputations. You know what I'm saying? Other people's reputations. You can find that once again in Cavos. A video from four years ago, you know, I'm Alex needs to be canceled, as well as, uh, once again, Becky Elizabeth. You know what I'm saying? Guys, it's not rocket science. You know what I'm saying? Just don't be a piece of shit online. Anyways, the more recent one, I'm Alex, YouTuber with 2 million subscribers. Is he, he was going after this girl, Alex, the, the woman making uh, new allegations against him, his ex-girlfriend. Anyways, new new stuff. I'm Alex, a YouTuber with over 2 million subscribers is being called out by his ex-girlfriend based on claims he both physically and emotionally abused her that he destroyed her property. I don't know how much of this is fact, how much of this is cap, um, but you know what? Uh, Barren proof lies within the court. Everyone is innocent till proven guilty. So Alice, the woman making these allegations, released several videos and audio logs of their interactions in a Google Doc along with an 82-page statement. I ain't reading all that. I'm going to be real with you. Uh, anyway, she ended up detailing her side of the story and alleged that he destroyed her property, got physical in fights, like physically started fighting her, stuff like that. Called her a whore, a psycho, and even the hard end word and several other derogatory. I, it's over. It's over for him, bro. Uh, anyways, here's the video of him threatening to absolutely bash her skull in. Yeah. Is that why you decided to go on the fucking offensive instead of the, the uh, maybe? Offensive. Okay. I don't, know, I don't know what to call what you did. It was weird. It's always weird. You always take the fucking weird route. Just do the normal route, which is... Just do the normal route, but a normal girlfriend yeah, would do like I didn't, I didn't mean it. just me, and that's something you really need to fucking fix. I'm gonna fucking bash your fucking head against the wall with a brick if you don't shut the fuck up. You, Because this one, genuinely, this one, this one, you, you fucked this. Royally okay. fucked this. If she doesn't shut up, it's quite... It's all right. I'm not gonna say it's funny, but I mean, <laughs> God damn. Uh, I'm gonna fucking bash your head against a wall with a brick if you don't shut the fuck up. Homeboy was on some rage arc, bro. I don't know what he's doing. Maybe he's pumping too much, Trent. It's okay. Relax. Wean yourself off, but bro, the gains will come. Just chase them constantly in the gym. It's all right, Alex. It's all right. Another video she released was from her shoving her phone in her pocket and leaving the recording on as she was packing her things and trying to leave. She claims the reason she felt she had to get out was because I'm Alex kicked her just before she started recording. You don't actually try and fix your fucking problems. It's fucking infuriating at this point. Like earlier, you're miserable about something and all you have to do is say what it is. You're complaining that I don't clean up after myself. N-word, neither do you. 
And yet another uh, video, Alex calls her a dog and claims that she f***s everything up for them. Um, there's a whole bunch of stuff. A Alice also claims that some of her belongings were destroyed when she picked them up after moving out, like her monitors, camera, and keyboard, along with pictures of her monitors. Uh, they're destroyed. These these are destroyed. Like, it's it's over. It's over. Alex said in other calls and messages that he hated her and that she made his life much more difficult and that he had general distrust of both her and some of his other friends. You might not have anything to lose. Your life might be down the drain. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, she just goes on and on and on and says all this other kind of stuff. Other messages depict Alex accusing Alice of ruining their vacation because she opened up to him about past experience with sexual assault. Um, just like, I'm going to be real. On vacation, let's not talk about that. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's vacation. I'll give Alex that. That puts me in a very weird... I'm not really good with those kinds of things. And most times I end up forgetting a lot of details in those kinds of things. So it's really just... I don't know. If you got a secret to tell me, uh, I'm probably going to forget about it. And I'm probably just going to forget about the whole secret regardless. Even if I was probably telling myself I wasn't supposed to tell anybody. That's the kind of person I am. I just forget things. That's why I'm great. You can tell me anything. I'm probably just going to forget it. <laughs> don't know what goes in one ear out the other crazy that's crazy i hope my wife doesn't see this anyways however words like this would quickly turn to please from alex once she decided to break off the relationship messages that went on for days without response as dictated in the screen recording from alex's phone i am not going to be playing that she also had dozens of screenshots in her document displaying this sort of behavior here to apologize again i'm sorry followed by i'm upset and i miss you and i want everything to be normal i will do everything to get back to you starting today all this other kind of stuff she ended up posting on twitter she goes here's my statement and then there's a huge google drive and i'm gonna be honest with you i am not going to 82 pages today. i don't know if you like to read alice's full statement see the video see the document uh in the description below it's her tweet and everything like that um it's over i'm alex your chalk bro you're a piece of shit i'm not gonna lie you're a piece of shit and that's the video folks